hey guys it's me welcome back to the channel if you're new my name is Vilma and today I'm going to be doing a mango jeans try on haul I've done one featuring a bunch of denim from Zara if you've not seen that video I will link it up here or in the info bar below a lot of you seem to really enjoy that video that I might be doing this every once in a while or maybe create this as a series here on my channel where I try maybe six to eight pairs of items or not pairs but items from that particular store and let you know my thoughts now if you are new here it's the first time you're watching one of my videos I would love for you to subscribe to my channel I do one to two videos a week related to fashion lifestyle and beauty so if you like the sound of that make sure that you hit that subscribe button right over there and click that bell notification so you don't miss any future videos from myself so if you're new here I'm gonna give you a few fun facts about myself I am five foot seven which is one meter 70 I wear size of 14 sometimes 12 UK which I believe it's around size 8 and 10 in the US um, or 42 40 to 42 in Europe and all the jeans that I'm going to be trying today are a size 14 because mango is not super generous with their sizing so I wanted to keep it true to the size that I believe I am um, so everything you're going to see here is a size 14 UK. I'm gonna be wearing the same body that I have right now is from Zara. I've done a haul featuring several different shades from this body. I'll link again here in the cards and in the info bar below. And the size that I'm wearing is a size large. And I'm also going to be wearing these mules which are new in my collection. So happy that I was able to catch these. These are from Marks and Spencers. I'll link them below. You need to grab them as quick as you can because in Marks and Spencers things tend to sell out very quickly, especially this type of shade and the heel as well, which is super neutral and it's really, really up my street. So I'm gonna be styling all the jeans that I'm gonna show you in this video, both with this body and these mules right here. Contender number one are called high waist cropped balloon jeans. And I ordered them in size 42 again, which is size 14 at UK. And they come in this really nice shade, which I feel is going to be very big for 2020, which is kind of like an acru type of shade, somewhat beigey or cream. Depends really which store, but I would call this a crew. So these ones, I really like it because the denim has no stretch. It's not a stiff denim. It's not super thick. It's quite light um, and it feels really comfortable around, well, against my skin, better saying. Now these, I feel like I should have sized down to a size 12. Obviously, I wasn't too sure because this is the first time I'm trying so many jeans from Mango, but I feel like the size 12 would have fitted me a lot better in this particular shade. I also like the stitching around the pockets. It's kind of like of a darker creamy shade, but I really, really like these ones. But unfortunately, because they are a little bit too big, I would highly recommend if you have similar body shape to mine and you like your jeans to be a little bit tighter to size down in these ones. Next, we have another pair of balloon jeans and a lot of the ones that I have here actually have that title, but they do look different. Um, these ones are called the Balloon Ankle Super High Waist Jeans and they are very different from the other ones. They have pleats, they have a concealed zipper with a no button, and they are very, very high waist, which is perfect. The length of this jeans is perfect. It's kind of like a 32 leg length. And I really, really like that because I am tall and sometimes jeans, for example, in Zara can be a little bit shorter on me, but these ones have the perfect length. Another thing that I really like about these jeans is the fact that you have this little clip right here, which makes them look a little bit tapered, but you can actually take that off and they look a little bit wider, but I still prefer the look of these jeans um, with the clip on. Now these ones are a little bit more expensive. As far as I can remember, these ones either cost 40 pounds or 50 pounds around that price region. Um, they are thicker in material. Um, they have no stretch and I feel like the 42 fits me really nicely. I think on the waist they are a little bit a little bit loose. 
However, I feel like that happens a lot with jeans at the moment for me because I've lost weight and on my waist, I feel like jeans are not fitting me properly. But these ones look really nice. Not really my style because I feel like they are more of a trendy piece. Um, I don't know if this is something I could wear next year, but I do really like them. Contender number three is also balloon high-waisted jeans. Again, they are a little bit different and I love the wash of these, very similar to the previous ones, but these ones look a little bit vintage and it's something that I really like. So these ones look like your regular jeans. They have buttons instead of having a zipper. And these ones are very, very fitted. These are my favorite ones out of this haul. As of now, I really like them. They are super high waist and there's not a lot of gap on the top part of the jeans, like on my waist, compared to uh, the first one that I used. I like the fact that the bottom is rolled up, but they don't have a raw hem. You could actually completely take this off, but I really, really love the fit of these. Again, the denim doesn't have a lot of stretch, um, so it's, it's thick. Um, and it really accentuates my curves, at least from the front, it looks really nice. I feel like I need to sit down a little bit with them so they stretch just a little bit to become a little bit more comfortable. But these are a true, I would say, 14. If you are a size 12, I even feel you can get away with these because they don't have a lot of space. Like there is a little bit of restriction in here but I really, really love them. Uh, prices, everything, I can't remember fully, but jeans from um, Mango are around 30 to 35 pounds, and I believe these ones are half that price. But I think these ones are quite comparable to the Levi's rib cage, which I tried before. I think these ones are similar to those, but just a fraction of the price. The next ones are slouchy jeans. Finally, something a little bit different to show you guys. I love this shade um, and I really wanted to try these because Zara has ones that have the same exact shade but they don't fit me properly and I wanted to try the ones from Mango just because I know their cut is a little bit more classic. So these ones are called the Slouchy Ankle High Waist, again in size 42. The pleats are not too bold which I really really like. These ones are a perfect length, although they are folded slightly at the bottom and they fit perfectly. There's not a lot of space like on my waist. I like when my jeans fit me perfectly on the waist because then the smallest part of my body stays accentuated, but then the rest kind of like just it doesn't call too much attention, if that makes any sense. So I do really, really like these ones. I feel like these ones are a keeper just as well as the ones that I tried before. I love the fact that I tried it with this kind of like a brownie shade, a dark brown. And my mules, I think it's going to be such a nice look for the upcoming season with a nice blazer or with a cute cardigan because cardigans are so in this year and I absolutely love these so definitely a keeper. The next jeans are also balloon jeans. They come in a very light wash. Um, they are called balloon cropped high waist jeans and these ones have a raw hem. I really love this shade. It reminds me of a pair of jeans that I had last year from top shop that obviously they don't fit me anymore anything that I was wearing last year doesn't fit me anymore but they were very very similar to these now these ones are very high waisted the denim is not rigid at all um, there's no stretch to them so perfect uh, for those of us who like to keep the shape of their denim um, and again I said it's high waist so it's perfect for us to really accentuate our waist now these ones have a tiny little bit of a gap on my waist but I also like my jeans when they loosen up a little bit I kind of like just allow them to hang slightly um, and these ones do fit a little bit different 
from my favorite ones that I showed before, which doesn't have a zipper. It comes with the buttons. Now this one has a zipper. I didn't even close it there, but yeah, I really love these ones. I'm not entirely sure if I'm going to keep these ones as well because I'm already thinking of keeping the other ones, but I love them. Um, highly recommend if you're looking for something like this with mules, um, sliders, it's just going to look so nice this upcoming season. So we're getting to the end of this video and I always like to leave my least favorites to last and that is what I'm going to talk right now. I only have one pair that I really didn't like the fit and it's these ones right here. They're also called balloon ankle high waist jeans um, but they look like this at the front. They have pleats. They're very similar to the slouchy jeans from Zara but they are just called balloon trousers. They do not have a raw hem. The material itself, like the denim itself, is a lighter feel type of denim. It does have a slight, like a very, very slight uh, stretch to it, um, but I don't like the fit of these. These are not made for my type of body shape. I feel somebody who's slender, slender, slimmer would fit very, very well, but if you have curves, a little bit of meat, you know, like me, it's not going to suit you, in my opinion. They are very nice, but I think only for someone who's slimmer. So these ones are definitely going back. They're my least favorite out of this video. Um, and showing you six pairs, only one I didn't like, that's not that bad. Okay guys, so that is it for today's video. I do hope that you guys enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments below which one of these you think I should keep, which one fit me the best. And let me know if you also like my mules. I will be doing a video, an updated video on 2020 um, trends, which will include cardigans, mules, all of that jazz. There's so much new stuff in the high street at the moment and I really want to bring that video for you guys. So let me know in the comments below what you want to watch next and if you like any of the jeans that I tried today. Thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you on my next video. Bye.